So the chocolate lights have bread and some grapes, a can of alphabet soup, and some peach flavored toothpaste. You look a bit young, miss. May I see your ID? Sure. I'm super glad I'm 23. I went to the store and picked out a Honda, and then I decided to name it Ron. When I went to confirm and grab my new keys, they said, No, no, I need your ID, please. This idea is not real. I'm not quite sure what to say. Your purchase of this Honda is on a delay. I went to the station to file a report. Felt crazy, like I was in an airport. I was getting people involved. This mystery really needs to be solved. Then I saw her pearl. She was in disguise. I pulled off a wig. That was when she tripped on a twig. Pearl, my thief, she denied and denied. And she finally looked so much more than horrified. I have my ID. I'm now so me. She's tried to steal, but I ain't free. I dumped it in the bathroom, all the bad things. Twice before you leave the property ground. Past books, checks, and the legal ID. It was absolutely not me. Identity thefts. Identity thefts. Be aware they could be standing just, just right there. there. Here are some things you can do. So this kind of that things that happen to you. First stop, don't share personal information. If you do, they might know your location. Collect your mail every day so people can't steal your life away. Complex passwords are the way to go because some people will stoop so low. Shred expired credit cards and receipts. It's not that hard, it's easy feat. Use security features on your mobile phone. Thumbprint locks will keep you in the safe zone. Review your credit reports every year, because if you don't, things won't be clear. And that would be a shame, my dear. I don't think you have so all around. Think twice before you leave the property ground. Passport's child with my uncle ID. It was absolutely not me. Identity thefts, who are? Identity thefts, who are? Be aware, they're standing just like that.